What's up? Are you at work, fool? Nah, I'm also on the weekends. Man. Why happened? That messes up all my plans, dude. <laughs> no, I, I was gonna come. I was gonna come by and grab the gaskets and shit for the engine. Doesn't mean that you can't. Yeah, I'd rather go when you're there, bro. I mean, I can go over there if you want. I don't know. Are you sure you're not busy or what? Maybe later. Like, what time? What time do they close? They close at seven now. Oh shit. Well, yeah, because all the bullshit they go at seven. Well, we close at seven thirty now. Yeah, let me put a list together and then maybe I'll head up there. I'll hit you yeah, up. Just let me know by the way I can head that way too, so that way I can, I can see what I can do on the pricing for you. All right, brother. Appreciate it. All right. I'll talk to you in a bit. No Late. All right. What up guys? I want to make a uh, quick list. Obviously you guys know we need to get like a lot of gaskets and everything. So what I'm going to do is just try to kind of think about everything that we're going to need. Brandon, grab me a piece of paper and a pen, please. But every time we get to the auto parts store, man, I always forget something. Every time. Never freaking fail. Like I mainly just want to do the rear main. I want to do a new valve cover gasket, new oil pan gasket. I can reuse the gasket for the intake manifold and I can reuse the gasket that's on the header. Shit, dude. I feel like I'm going to forget something Ooh, spark plugs we'll get the ngkrs put spark plugs i'll get oil at walmart no you can't beat walmart's price on oil bro i'm sorry oh shit actually antonio can price match yeah so put oil uh, i already have some more synchro mesh inside of there i have coolant i'm gonna forget something dude i know i am Do we need this belt right no i'm gonna use the timing belt off of this they don't have the gates racing, the, the gates racing timing belt at O'Reilly's anyway. So I'm going to reuse my timing belt. I'll probably use the water pump off of this because it's new. Oh, timing belt tensioner. Oh, you know what? I can take all that off of there too. My timing belt, the tensioner, the water pump, everything is all brand new on this. You guys already know that. And I, I don't know. I mean, I feel like people are probably going to say don't reuse that shit, get new. But I, dude, I think the stuff that's on here is still just fine. I mean, fuck, what does it have on it? Like 100 miles? Not even 100 miles probably has like 10 miles dude i don't want to think about it i don't want to think about it what else what else what can else the list so you can remember? yeah go over it all right rear main seal valve cover gasket oil pan gasket water neck o-rings because you said spark plugs and oil <sighs> I don't know, dude. I'm just gonna send it. I guess whenever we're there with, uh, whenever we get up to O'Reilly's, I can just talk about it with Antonio. Maybe he might come up with some shit that I'm forgetting, bro. But for the most part, I think that's good. I think that's pretty much all that we need uh, to move forward on this. And then other than that, we got to get all the stuff off of this engine. So um, that's obviously gonna have to be whenever we get this ripped out. But yeah, screw it. Let's hit the road, man. Brandon, let's go. Grab the lisp. <laughs> What are you listening to? I'm going through Instagram. This is actually pretty relaxing, huh? Never doing that again, bro. That was tripping. Look at that ugly ass dog. That thing was fluffy. That thing was ugly. Oh. Well, we're gonna have to wait a little while for Antonio to show up. So he's, he's gonna meet us at the O'Reilly's and get some parts because uh, Antonio always hooks me up on the pricing. You know what I'm saying? What are you doing over here? Oh, I'm gonna get you guys. Yeah, go to the other side of the car. But while we're waiting, I figure why not? I'm gonna give Braven the opportunity to do some driving in this empty ass parking lot. So you gotta scoot your seat up on the side. It's on the side. The seat's electric. Scoot up to where you can comfortably reach the pedals. You shouldn't have to move it much actually since you're like taller than me now. Yeah, pull it down and then adjust the steering wheel where you want it. Like up, down, in, out. All right, you're set, bro. Ready to rock, man. Shift this dang thing into launch right now, and then we'll take off. Okay, your left foot it over there. See that little dead pedal? Yeah, you're not going to use that foot. You don't use that foot at all. You understand me? In an automatic, no left foot. Use your right foot. The right pedal is gas. Go ahead and hit it. All right, and then the left pedal is the brake. So hold the brake and shift in the drive. I'll just drive. Automatic, bro. There ain't nothing else to it. <laughs> Try not to hit nothing's all that I ask. Put your damn seatbelt on, bro. You already failed. You already, you didn't tell already me, failed. You didn't tell me that stuff. I guess I should put my seatbelt on too, so at least one of us lived through this. All right, do you see the lanes? Let, let's kind of pretend like we're actually trying to follow lanes here. So you go straight. At the end of the lanes, just stop, and then we'll turn right. Just kind of get the hang of that, and then. 
turn right. You didn't use your blinker. You're you're in oncoming traffic's lane. <laughs> okay, speed up for speed bumps. Screw it. <laughs> <laughs> you're supposed to slow down for speed bumps, man. Jesus Christ. Unless you're in mat. Go straight and then turn right here. There's really not very many obstacles in this parking lot, but yeah, we need a parking lot that actually has like lines so you can get used to kind of staying in a lane. You know what I'm saying? I mean, this since being this is like a brand new car, it's really easy to drive. It's not like, I don't know. It's an automatic, bro. What is there really to learn? I think for the most part, whenever learning with an automatic, you just have to learn like the laws and how to perform form on the street keep it straight stay in your lane use your blinkers use your all blinker. that kind of shit it's the left one no you don't pull it push it push it up for right push it down for left you've driven before haven't you no. this is your first time i've never letting you drive another car before not even gap huh that's weird roll your window up for these weirdos don't know weirdos coming up to the window like ah corona blah, 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 blah. freaking zombies <laughs> why is there so many people in the parking lot now this is like a drug addict neighborhood Whoa. You want to try the main road? No. You don't want to try the main road? Why not, bro? Full send, dude. I've got full coverage insurance. We're good. We're straight. What the hell was there a car behind us for? Like, why'd you have to come close to us? It's a full empty ass parking lot. Why'd you have to come close to us, motherfucker? I think the methadone clinic just closed with all these freaking people in the parking lot. <laughs> Uh, you don't know what that is. That's probably good. Dude, why do I hear? Yeah, you're using two feet. Really? Yeah, that left foot, don't use it. Only one foot. Is that a bad thing? Yeah, because it, yeah, it's a very bad thing because you get confused and you'll accidentally hit the gas instead of the brake or vice versa. That happened earlier. Yeah, that just happened. Remember, if you are stopping, there's no reason to press the gas pedal. If you are wanting to drive forward, then there's no reason to press the brake pedal. So you only use one foot. <laughs> Look at the one chick with the glasses on is like interested in us. Like, uh oh, what are they, what are they doing? They're trying to bust us. <laughs> All right, hang on, drop me off right here. I'm gonna. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> Holy crap! I'm sorry. Did I you hit the brake hard enough? Like, that just about took my collarbone out, bro. <laughs> Holy freaking crap. You shouldn't have said it that fast. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna get out right here. Do that same square that you're just doing in the parking lot. I'm just gonna get some out of the car footage really quick. What? But but stay away from the tweakers. Don't drive next to them. I'm afraid they'll jump in and try to take the car from you and I won't be able to make it there in time. Nah, I'll just put the gas. <laughs> He cracks me up using his blinker in the parking lot, but I get it. He's got to get he's got to get used to using his blinker and stuff I'm surprised. I've never taken him driving before. I've always just taken my daughter's drive. Oh great Police officer pulling in lovely Please he's not coming for us. We're on private property. I think that's legal, right? Dude, where is he going? He's driving through the dirt Focus, motherfucker. You look like a little spoiled white boy right now. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm just saying, bro. Like, a little young white kid in a nice looking car. Yo, how much did your parents pay for your car, man? Uh, someone's on the phone. <laughs> Who is it? I don't know. Hello? Hey, uh, Brayman. What's up? Tell your dad that I'm almost by the store. All right. He's on the store. All right. We'll be there right now. Yo, did you see that cop come flying in? No. You didn't see it? I seen you recording it when I was doing it. Yeah, right Right whenever you started to drive off and I'm right here, then a cop come pulling in. I'm like, are you freaking kidding me right now? <laughs> in a parking lot. Oh my God, I got to reposition everything. What the hell? We're here. Got my list. If you want, you can roll the window down, but you're staying in here. Sorry, bro. Sorry, man. Safety first. What up, dog? Gotta do the feet, man. Oh, okay. You gotta do that. Uh, there you go. What's up, dog? What's, What's up? up? <laughs> <laughs> That's the rear main seal. Oil pan. Bam, bam, bam. Hell yeah. God, bro, look at the fucking line. Really? Really a long ass freaking line to get in the Home Depot right now. Yeah, you're free to go. Go ahead. You're free to go there, dude. <laughs> you know? Not like I'm bigger than you or nothing. Well, I just wanted to stop and get a shovel really quick. 
couple of shovels for digging holes for the spray booth. We have one rinky ass freaking shovel at home. Like, the thing's old as hell. Isn't it like a wood handle that's yeah. like all splintering? Yeah, I wanted to grab a new shovel, bro. Maybe a post hole digger, but, but, COVID-19 crap. You see that? I mean, that was a, I'm not gonna go stand in a line for 30, 40 freaking minutes just to get in the Home Depot. Not doing it, I'm sorry. Go to Walmart. Walmart has shovels? Yeah. Walmart does have shovels. And don't we need something else from Walmart too, so? Oil. Oil, yes, exactly. So, out of the way. And this, they're in the same area. My nose itches so bad, but I don't want to touch my face. I need to wash my hands. Don't touch your face! I haven't got out the car! <sighs> yeah, exactly. Whatever. Hey! Using my shoulder, bitch. All right, we're home. It's scary out there, huh? Get all my dang old gaskets. Ah, oh, you couldn't leave the gate open for a brother? What's up, man? Jeez. Bang. All right, so we got the spark plugs. I got the oil pan gasket. Got the valve cover gasket in which I was thinking I really don't even need this, man. I'm sure the valve cover gasket's still good on here. I mean, crap, dude. That would have saved me 25 bucks. And this is the rear main seal set. Man, can y'all believe that all this crap cost, where'd it go? 82 freaking dollars. $82 for these lousy ass gaskets, bro. That's freaking ridiculous. But yo, dude, stoked on this oil pan gasket. Okay, look, this is actually the focus. Focus. Okay, we're well, gonna take my word for it. This is the one that has the metal. You see, you can actually see it. That little silver like line next to it. It's got the the rubber and then the metal and then the rubber. Like this is that badass one, bro. Like holy shit, I was stoked whenever I noticed that. I was like hell yeah. So got the good oil pan gasket. Definitely happy about that. What's up? How'd it go? How'd what go? Braven. Braven driving? Yeah. Oh, good. It was a lame ass parking lot. Does he suck? No. It's pretty. Does he suck? No. It, what sucks, it was a lame ass parking lot. We literally went in like this square. You know what I mean? And I kind of had him use his blinkers while doing it. But it, it's like, there, there's nothing to learn. There's no lines to stay in. I need to find somewhere better. And then we went to go to freaking Home Depot and Home Depot has a line all the way around the fucking block. Whatever. I wasn't gonna stand in that line. You should go to the lake this next weekend. The lake? Yeah. I'm not going to the lake. If you plan on going to the lake, make sure to take some limes with you. Limes? Yeah, limes. Why? For all the corona. The fuck? You're so stupid. That's such a dad joke. You couldn't catch on to that? Anyhow, Braven did pretty good driving the car, but I mean it's an automatic, bro. There's nothing to it, right? I think it's time to step it up a notch. And the BMW just so happens to be the only car here that I have running that is a stick. <laughs> I'm gonna make it interesting. Yes, yes I am. I'm gonna make it very interesting. Braven, come here. I've got a deal for you. Deal, you say? I always like some deals. Alright, we're gonna drive the BMW next. And what's the difference between the BMW and the Ultima? Ultima's an automatic. Yeah. yeah. Alright, now check it out. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna give you absolutely zero instruction. Zero instruction whatsoever. If you can your very first start, your very first start off, do you think that you can do it without stalling the car? This is this is gonna uh, be his first time driving um, a stick. Yeah, I think you do it. Your very first one? Yeah. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. All right. I'm going to give you absolutely zero instruction whatsoever. I'm going to give you 30 minutes from not right now to research as much as you can. Like, if you got to look up a YouTube video to try to learn how to drive a stick, how to start off in first for beginners, whatever, to get a good grasp, you're going to get absolutely zero instruction from me. But if you can do your very first, your very first takeoff without stalling the car, I'll give you 20 bucks. All right. I bet. Bet. <laughs> What'd you say? I said I'm not getting 20 bucks. <laughs> hey, bro, no confidence. What time is it? It is 5.51. Yeah, no, no, actually no. Yeah, I'll give you till 6.30. Yeah, so it's like 10 minutes till 6 right now. So I'm giving you till 6.30. So that's basically 40 minutes. That's four, dude, that's damn near an hour, bro. He's gonna stall. 
What? What? I 40 think I minutes. Have a, I think I have a new deal for you. A new deal? What is yeah, this? Yeah, new deal. Okay, if I can do it, get it done, first try, then you, then we have to stream Forza Horizon 4. But I don't have Forza Horizon no, 4. Then we just get a bite. Ugh. <laughs> All right, deal. Let's go. This dude just freaking hustled me, man. What the fuck? So now $60 on. Hold up a minute. Hey, what do I get? Uh, what do I get if you don't do it? Because you just upped it to 60 freaking dollars worth of a fucking video game. What the hell is it that I get? Dude, manual labor. No, you gotta dig the holes. <gasps> That's not fair. You gotta dig the holes all by yourself. I'm gonna go out there and mark them. All right. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'll end up helping him because he'll do it way too damn slow. Anyhow, timer starts now. I'll pick the camera up here shortly after he does his research. This dude is sitting out there in the car practicing. He's seriously sitting in the car freaking practicing right now. I think I gave him too much time. But it doesn't matter. It don't matter. We're going to win this, guys. <laughs> I mean, hell, I mean, this is one of those situations where I want to win. I'm not going to lie. I want to win. But at the same time, I wouldn't mind losing. We'll see. He could be a natural. Who knows? Just like me. When I first got it, man. What's up? I'm ready. Ready? 627 with a couple minutes to spare. You're ready. Okay, Any more looking at it, I'm going to forget it. <laughs> all right. I'm going to pull the car up. I forgot all the steps. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Man, this thing is so clean in here. Ooh, scary moments. Scary, scary, scary moments. If I get this, then we get to have live streams. I'm playing Forza. Yeah, I don't have to start till 6.30. Got two minutes. Uh-oh. I'm going to win this bet. I have confidence in myself. I have confidence. I'm going to win this. You ready for this? <laughs> you got all your training. <laughs> oh. Really? I'm wondering if he even, he's staring right at me. I'm wondering if he remembers the e-brake. <laughs> he's so nervous. First try. He forgot the e-brake. He forgot the e-brake. He for he for he for yeah, <laughs> dude! Holy crap! Look, technically, technically, I win, bro. Technically, I win. But yo, check this out. I set you up, and but it's not necessarily that I set you up. Like this is real shit because if you were to get in this car, one of the very first steps that you have to do before taking off is drop the damn e-brake. I thought that you already dropped that. Why would I have already dropped that? I, I was walking you. away from the car. You apply the e-brake in a manual car because it's not in park, it can roll. You have to put the e-brake up. You failed my dude, but I'll tell you what, I'm gonna give you a second chance because I'm a good guy and I'm really happy about how clean the interior of this car is. I mean, we did an absolutely bang up job, you know what I'm saying? So, one more try. Hey, drop the e-brake, huh? Come on, man, let's get this. <laughs> I would've had it if I... Hey, yeah. <laughs> See, I would have got What's it up? This wasn't What's up? <laughs> I don't know, man. Put it down in the comments whether I should let this dude be the winner right now. Because technically, I won. I'm no, sorry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Technically, that was first time. Because, like, dude, the e brake. Dude, e -brake. yes. That's step number one before you go to take off is drop the e brake. I'm sorry, bro. You failed. <laughs> What the fuck? Hot oh, damn, how you doing? <laughs> I got it rolling without stalling. Put the e brake down. No! <laughs> he didn't put the e brake down. down. What's up, buddy? <laughs> all right, now, all right, all what are you doing here? Right. Hey, 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 chill out there, cowboy. Hey, there's a fucking curve there, you know? <laughs> the hell, fool, you sound like a paisa. I am a paisa. <laughs> To the patio. There's plenty of room back here. 
<laughs> That's good. We're making more bets in this video or what? So what do you think? You think you're capable of doing a push up with a 60 pound bag on your back? You think you can do it? I mean, it's worth a try. $100. You think you can do it? I, I don't know, man. I think you made this bet a little too easy on him. No, trust me, those things are hard. Yeah. <laughs> me? No, that's not the bet, man. You got to do it first. <laughs> Remember, the whole push up is you got to lay on the floor mm -hmm. and then I'm putting it and you got to get up and then do the push up. How many push ups do you want me to do? Just one. You, you got to go from the floor yeah, from to the up. Floor. So basically, so, from the floor, so basically um, you got to be like this on the floor and then I'm going to put it. Because if you go like this, you know, I won't be able to put it right and it's going to slip back. Wait, does he get to sign the waiver? <laughs> There's no right. way. You ready? You sure? Don't toss it on my back. Well, of course I'm not gonna toss it on your back. <laughs> Put your back on it. This is a hundred dollar bet right now. <laughs> all right, up all the way, all, all the way. Oh, you lose your knees. Oh. <laughs> I saw you straining, bro. <laughs> You almost had it! Why did you use your knees? I would've had it. Damn, bro. <laughs> I would've had it, but you I You would've had yourself a hundred dollars, you would've got yourself that game. Oh, I mean, what man. can we say? That's the second bet Braven has lost in this damn video. What's up? But anyhow, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. I gotta actually start on the next one. We got all the wood and got all the supplies for starting on the spray booth, so I'm definitely stoked for that. Peace out, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Are you gonna say bye, Braven? No. No, he's, he's pissed. He lost two bets in a row. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him bye, Junior. Peace.